welcome back friends uh, in our last class we have discussed uh, about uh, draggable function so in this class we are going to discuss about dropable so the title is drop dropable function so you can see this the result that we have uh, created in our last class and this disable you can see it's here i'm just going to remove this and control s to save refresh again now you can see and because we have used here uh, contain main uh, river true we are going to remove all this from here and control s refresh now we can just drop drag this you can see anywhere so inside this class uh, we are just going to create another div here we start div close i'm just creating id here id is equal to you can say you can give any name i'm just giving drop able so you can just call this inside css uh, for id we are using hash and the name of uh, the id is dropable open curly braces and define a width for this something like 300 pixel and the height also should be 300 pixel uh, background color same color purple and border you can just give the 3px solid red border and float should be right float right you can save this and just come here refresh so you can see we have another box here i want to just uh, drop this inside this one from here to here so in first step what can you do you can just uh, come here uh, you can just uh, write a comment for example second function second function start so from here you will uh, just start the second function uh, for second function you can just uh, write here inside this uh, you can start dollar sign round bracket dot another round bracket semicolon inside the first one you can insert uh, you can see a single quotation and for id we are using hash and call here drop able and here we are using just uh, css or just not css here you can just uh, write here drop able drop able you can call drop able and curly braces here inside the curly braces again dollar sign round bracket dot another round bracket single quotation so inside this one uh, you can just uh, come here you can just write drop uh, function yes function should be done here function round bracket and uh, curly brace you know the rule of function you can just cut this from here control x and you can paste here inside this control v so inside this we are going to call uh, the dropable function inside the single quotation for id we are using hash and uh, this dropable you can see it's here you can just copy control c and paste here and here we are using css css and inside uh, the curly braces i'm just going to insert some property and value here for example background background should be orange orange control s now just come back here and refresh so we have just told here when we are just uh, moving or dropping this uh, from here to here the background color should be changed from purple to orange so you can see it is working at first uh, it's purple when you are just dropping this here uh, this element on this one the color is going to change in orange so you can just give uh, anything for example box shadow you can give here and just for separating we are using comma and uh, for using property and value uh, we are just using uh, single quotation between uh, property and value you are using column for example box shadow uh, box shadow should be something like box shadow you can say zero pixel then zero pixel then just 15 px the color of shadow should be black black color you can save this now refresh now you can see this this shadow 
so the same way if you just uh, you can just come here uh, inside the first function here I'm just saying uh, another function another function start and here you can just write uh, you can insert dollar sign front bracket and other and semicolon inside this you can insert single quotation and you can select id you can call drop able and here also we are writing css inside the single uh, curly braces we are just going to insert some uh, single quotation colon and single quotation and for separating uh, second property we are using uh, comma and another just single quotation colon single quotation so we are just going to use here something like uh, background should be just uh, something like uh, yellow yellow background not yellow you can just give any other color from the blue color and here you can say border border should be changed uh, it should be just uh, 8 pixel of border type should be solid and the color should be red let's check control s and refresh so you can see uh, just refresh when you are just moving this uh, just the color you can see it uh, it's changing from purple to blue but when you are just dropping this the color is changing from blue to orange but uh, border attribute is not working here border at px solid red not semicolon here control x once again refresh and check you can see this working at first the border is uh, only three pixel when you are just moving this uh, so just focus on the border so you can see it's going to change in eight pixel of solid uh, red border and the color is going to change from purple to blue and now you can see the background color is changing from blue to orange so you can just what can you do you can add a paragraph tag here inside this diff p star and p close simply you have just added a p tag here inside this so for example you can just come here uh, after this uh, round break you can put a dot and you can just write here find find what so find p and inside the p you can just write text txt and whatever you want you can just write here for example drop here you can just save this now come back here and refresh now you can see when you are just moving this here should be written a text so you can see there is written drop here so you can change this text so when you are just uh, dropping your element here inside this so you can just come here after this uh, parentheses you can insert a dot and you can just say find find what find p means paragraph tag and after that we are writing a text here uh, something like uh, dropped you can see control s or you can just write here drop done control s something different refresh now you can see now there is written drop here when you are just dropping there's written drop done so like this you can just uh, uh, create drop function inside jquery you can see it's very easy just by doing a single line of code you can just uh, perform this kind of task you can see at first uh, the both background colors are purple and you can see there uh, that three pixel uh, red border we have but when we are just moving this uh, element so you can see there is many changes here the background color is changing blue color the border is changed from three pixel to eight pixel and we have a text here but when you are just dropping this so there is a uh, background color is uh, changed from blue to orange and the text color also the text uh, also change you can see it drop done At first uh, there was written drop here so it was about uh, drop function the UI ui dropable function i hope uh, this is clear for you you are understand so till next video have a nice time and see you